So, Jimmy, what do you think? Sorry. What do you think? Oh, these. Yeah, the um, Audio Technica ANC9 noise cancelling headphones. And they certainly seem to cancel a bit of noise there. <laughs> yeah, they do. Look, I actually I took these out to a couple of gigs yeah. um, recently when I was doing some recording stuff. Um, and I was in an environment where I had quite a lot of punter noise around me. Mm. Uh, and look, it's in a perfect world, you cancel out everything and you can't you can't realistically do that with headphones. There's stuff that's always going to get through if it's loud yeah, enough. Yeah, but yeah. the amount of background noise it cuts out is is quite quite amazing. These uh, these acoustic cancelling headphones. Yep. Um, you see them all the time on planes. I think they're not for everybody. I think there's some people they suit really well, and some people have a lot of trouble with them just in general. Yeah, look, I, I think sort of like all headphones, really, it, it yeah. is a personal choice. And noise cancelling is something that's either going to work for you or it's not. Mm. Um, and I wasn't really sold on it, but um, but I, I'm coming around after using these. Uh, I'll say that my experience of these is um, they're probably a little too small for my ears. I mean, it sounds like a stupid thing, but I didn't find these as comfortable as as some. They do seal very well against your head. The the noise cancelling works um, quite surprisingly. You turn it on, there's a short delay, and then it goes click and noise well, it vanishes. Doesn't go click, it just stops making noise. Yeah. <laughs> well, it starts making inverse noise, really. But but it's it's a very it doesn't sort of suddenly fade slowly fade in. It just the background noise one, floor just yeah, goes. The, yeah. the background noise just goes. You definitely know that it is doing. There's no question that it's doing its thing, and it's it's picking up the um, external sounds through these two microphones here. Um, in, in terms of like how I feel, I, I put on these, and, and again, this is maybe all noise cancelling headphones with me, I, I sort of feel like my ears are being sucked out a little bit. It and, leaves and you with that sort of, uh, I'm kind of in an anechoic chamber feeling. But not quite. But not quite, but not exactly. Quite. Now, connecting these, uh, you know, the, this has the little four... Uh, pin plug that we've come to associate with with eye thingies yeah. and that's because there's a microphone here and I'd certainly have to hope that the microphone is noise cancelling as well but clearly you could be using this in a relatively noisy environment and still be able to hear you know your mother-in-law or whoever's calling you for dinner on the phone or you know somebody else is, is got to be able to talk to you um, for, for that sort of environment these would be a, these would be something you could wear all day you know if you're yeah. operating heavy machinery or something it's not such a silly thing to be wearing something like this no well look I, I think um, as you say it, it's it's a personal thing and and it, what sort of what got me was I I, I kept them on for a couple of hours and mm. I actually found them really comfortable mm. which is strange because I've got an enormous head um, and I, absolutely uh, it, it's not all just ego um, there is some <laughs> knowledge in there but no I've got a really big head yeah and um, and a lot of things aren't comfortable on me mm. hats especially mm. but I, I was good with these and the other thing about the noise cancelling is there's a variety of modes and you can press the button and it beeps and the, the LED on the side changes colour. Blue is aircraft mode, red is office mode and green is I think library mode. Mm. Um, although in the library there's supposed to be people going shush anyway. Yeah, Maybe yeah. that's what it gets it, rid it of. It cuts out the shush. Yeah, that's it. But look, um, one other thing to know is that when you turn off the noise cancelling, they do continue to pass audio, but the sound um, of the audio that passes through it changes, to my mind, quite radically. It gets pretty boxy. And yeah, that was a bit of a surprise. It's yeah. th these, um, the, what would we say? The mids are sort of a little bit laid back. Actually, they're a lot laid back. And when you turn the power off, they're even more laid back. Um, not quite quite the same as some some other say non um, acoustic headphones that uh, the, you know with a lot more mids. Mm. And um, oh, look, I, I think that that's probably a function. Uh, Audio Technic has probably figured out that that you know they can make it sound better with a little bit of proprietary uh, equalization. I yeah. think that's probably what's going on yeah. in the noise cancelling as well. But there's certainly uh, plenty of output from the average eye thingy. You know, there was no shortage of volume. You could no you, look, you get rid of all the background noise and then blast your eardrums off. Yeah, you can you can get them pretty loud. You get them up to a point actually um, where if you do put too much signal into them. With the cancelling switch on, they will actually automatically mute, and I I think this is probably um, a hearing protection before thing. they do some damage. Yeah, before mm. before they get real to the point of being really damaging. I mean, don't get me wrong, they're loud, mm. but um, before they get to the point of being damagingly, uh, so yeah. they will actually 
shut down until you reduce the input level. Yeah, uh, it's certainly very solid. Um, they're easy to uh, adjust. The the headband is comfortable, and that's um, that's a material fairly easy to keep clean. Which, by the way, is important. You're putting this on your head. You know, it's whatever's in your hair is going to transfer to there. And um, you'll notice that they they move round very comfortably like that. So they'll adjust to almost any sort of and, shape. And check it out. You can you can even do the one sided DJ. Do, 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 do. That sort of thing, yeah. yeah. They come in a little case. I think, look, I think where these are sort of pitched at seems to be, uh, I, I guess, the consumer market. They come with a lead to plug or an adapter to plug into an airplane yeah. headphone socket. So you could certainly take them traveling, and I think they'd, they'd work really well. And I think they'd work really well, you know, even on the train. Not mm. that I catch mm. a train a lot, but um, this would probably make it more pleasant um, if only they could clean the floor as well. But, um, yeah, look, for for something that sort of seems to be in a consumer, I guess, market, I actually think they've got some, some merit as a pro product. Mm. I think the bottom line is this is not a device that's going to suit absolutely everybody. We know that headphones are always a personal taste. Totally. You like the sound or you don't like the sound. The noise cancelling is very effective. There's absolutely no question when it's on and that it, it does work. I think what you want to do is get a pair of these and wear them, from a little, wear them for a little bit, see if they're right for you before you buy them. But there's a lot about this to, to recommend. Yeah, definitely. And look, especially in, in the market of, of noise cancelling headphones these are actually pretty well priced too mm. so um worth checking out audio technica anc9